welcome to another vlog. I am so excited to do my nails today. I just wanted to say that first and foremost. Dude, I was doing my hair and my sister's hair clip broke my nail, so. Guess what guys? It's been so long since I've seen my boyfriend and he's finally coming over tomorrow. I am so excited. Personally, we decided that we're gonna hang out tomorrow. And we're also gonna celebrate my belated birthday together. So we have a lot of things to prep girls, especially our nails. I just wanted to do my nails just in general, so don't do it for your man, do it for yourself. My friend Hannah, you guys know her. She sent me a thoughtful birthday gift and I got this a little late because I didn't go check my mail downstairs and we don't get notifications. This was her card, I literally smiled so hard happy late birthday Faye I saw your vlog about baking with your man so I thought you could have a waffle date with this miss you love you from Hannah and Penny <laughs> oh my gosh I'm so excited look how gorgeous the clouds are today that's just beautiful we have to get batter so my sister and I are gonna go to the store we needed to go to the Asian store anyway so that's why I showed my boyfriend the gift as well he's like go get batter and hopefully this weekend we can make some Waffles. Per usual, I made a grocery list, not as organized this time. Let's be on our way. I'm also gonna take down these boxes to recycle downstairs and come home and do my nails. This is the OOTD today. Um, just ignore because I am on my monthly still, so I'm just trying to be comfortable, you know? Anyway, let's go. By the way, these are the shoes my brother got me for my birthday. Finally, new running shoes. My old running shoes are so disgusting. I don't even wanna go close to it. I just need to throw all of that away. <laughs> I've had these for like, I don't know how many years mm, four over four years and I never got new running shoes my brother got me new shoes they're so bouncy I love the neon love the hint of pink this is the fit I love how small they make my feet look I mean my feet's already really small but it makes it look super narrow a zip you put your feet in haha -ha. zip it up and then you can velcro the side <laughs> Why are there so many cars out? Oh, apples open. Apples open. Of course. Hello, uh, people. It's so nice to see people. She finished first year of med school, so we're celebrating with the photo. A photo. And grocery shopping. And grocery shopping. Little road, little stop. These are the bushes that we're going to embark on. Remember when we sewed this on? So we had to sew this on her thing and it took- I sewed it on. Well, I had to wear it and then I had to pin it and then- <laughs> <laughs> It was a team effort. You're welcome. Okay. Embark on those bushes. Oh my gosh, I was snapping so long. Who are you snapping? I don't know, but there's people. I don't know how close to you. Yeah. What? <laughs> One, two, three. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Oh, dogs! Taking the photos, and I'm coaching her the poses. What more can I do? Maybe you're too low. How's it going? They like it? No. Oh, that's not me. <laughs> Look at that cloud. I'm gonna go to the grocery store. I don't know if I want to vlog. We were gonna go to the Asian Mart, but then it's closed. I'll vlog on my phone and sanitize my phone. The grocery store today is kind of packed, to be honest. So everyone's wearing masks, everyone's away from each other. I pull out hand sanitizer before I touch my phone. I know even still I shouldn't, but I'm gonna go home and use rubbing alcohol to do disinfect my phone anyway. Um, but yeah, I can just get But yeah, here's our cart. Okay, we're home now. I just got done sanitizing my phone with rubbing alcohol, obviously washing my hands for a minute. But I'm gonna put some groceries away, so. I can't wait to have my ice cream. By the way, I'm so sorry I pronounced this tahin wrong. I said tajin, and I was like dragged in the comments, but that's totally fine, that's my mistake. Anyway, so I deserve it. I bought a whole bunch of frozen food. I know it's not gonna eat processed food, especially if you're trying to like science. I'm okay. I'm getting hungry, I don't know if you noticed. We should put some dishes away, shall we? Oh. Oh, you come here often? 
So I am just currently putting away some laundry that I left out in my room. I changed into some gym clothes because I am gonna work out in a little bit. Remember when I did a haul on my channel for um, <laughs> lip help? And this purple outfit, sweat outfit, so it's a t-shirt and then some sweatpants underneath. Well, here's the gray one that I didn't get to show because it was in the laundry for the longest time. I normally like to hang my sets on a hanger like this. Look how cute this color is though. A nice cool tone ashy charcoal gray you can hang it like this as you can tell here's the gray version and then the lilac version I really have to go through my closet one of these days it's getting way too compact Okay, I know you can't tell, but a bunch of these are bathing suits I bought from Amazon. I'm meaning to do a video, so please just wait. Oh, this should go in here. This is the basket where I keep all my YouTube reviews. This is worth like $350, guys, and it's just on my floor. Since tomorrow, my boyfriend and I are going to the lake, I need to pick out a bathing suit top from that pile. But we'll do that in a little bit. I'm currently on my way to the trash room to throw away the trash. This cardigan, I wrapped it around so it wouldn't open. <laughs> Makes me look like a divorced mother. You know that TikTok? People used to abandon their boxes, their cardboard boxes in the trash room. My sister and I used to complain about it all the time. Like, why would people do that? You're not, you're not supposed to do that. We're such Karens. And finally, the apartment realized it was an issue. So they put up a sign that says, if you leave your boxes, you can be charged less. <laughs> Okay, so out of this pile, if I could just move my ring light and all these cords away. Um, this is a pile of swimsuits and I don't remember what is what, which is which. Look how fun this one is. What is a smart way to approach this without opening everything? I'm gonna go look at my Amazon purchase history and hopefully I can pair it up with my own eyes because a lot of the bathing suits I bought are quite similar. I'm so sorry that my room is so yellow. The sun is right above me. I'm going on my orders right now. Look at what we have here. I will be doing a main channel video if you're curious to see me try on all these bathing suits. I just have to wait for my period to be gone and then, ooh, look at the one shoulder white top. This one's cute too. I do like the snake skin, so we're probably gonna try that one on. They're all so cute! I love how you guys are helping me pick up my bathing suit for tomorrow, even though um, I don't think I'll be wearing the bottoms. I'm just gonna be wearing jeans. So I pulled out the Tempt Me red one, this yellow one, and then the snakeskin one. It's a little bit boobalicious. Anyway, this is the top. It has like a little bow here. It's just a little bit too boobish. Let me go find the short that I want to wear this with. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if I want to wear light jeans or dark jeans. Light jeans? Or the dark. Okay, so here's the top with dark jeans. I kind of like it with the dark jeans only because I feel super bloated. So with the lighter jeans, I feel a little bit suffocated, you know? It gives me room to do whatever. Ah, my cankles. <laughs> but okay, let's try a different top. A red top, this bottom. There's one that's strapless. My sister says that that one is a lot cuter. So we might have to try that one too. Hold on, beats ass. I don't really know how I feel about this one. It's a little bit boobylicious too, but I mean like, I feel like a mom in her 30s. Charlie, come get a towel. That's how I feel. I like red and me though, but I don't know. Um, maybe not this one. I don't know, I just. Okay, first of all, I need to adjust the straps. This will be so much cuter if I had the bottoms on, but because I'm not wearing the bottoms, I think the winner is the snakeskin one, the first one we tried. So let me just try that one more time and we'll see. Just one more time. You know how girls are. We're always like retrying and retrying. This is the final look. We're gonna wear a sweater on top. So what I'm gonna do is just wear a sweater because low key, you guys know I'm a skincare fanatic, so I don't want UV rays on my skin like TBH. My boyfriend is very like, oh my god, just enjoy the sun, please. You're so scared of the sun. Why are you so scared of the sun? Just enjoy it. Oh my gosh, for one day. Oh my gosh. <laughs> well, he was like that on text. Well, this is the outfit. I gotta do my nails now. So I'm gonna be sassy and go for these nail design. It kind of matches my uh, snake skin. Get my light out and I have everything in here. I need to cut and file my nails a bit. I realize with the more square shape, it'll be easier to form onto your nails without a lot of creasing. My nails typically grow fast, but they're really, they can be fragile. But surprisingly, they've gotten a lot more strong. Time to file them and shape them. 
Also in my blog when I was removing my nails, a lot of people said Faye use acetone. I don't know why I didn't think of that, but you could use acetone and or cooking oil. I think so. Look how nice. They're filed and soft. Ooh. This is that broken glass glitter, and this is just a matte or glossy, glossy, glossy. Charcoal blue gray, I'm not sure. And then we have the French tip one with that same gold glitter across the bottom. Yeah, yeah. So like before, I'm just gonna go ahead and look at which one fits my nails. And make sure you're picking a size that's a little bit bigger than you think would fit your finger because that was my mistake last time. So I'm gonna put a glass one on my thumb. Wait, I totally forgot to alcohol my fingernails. Let's go ahead and use an alcohol swab. Clean the surface of our fingernails. One is plenty. Perfect sizing. You can also press it against the table just to make sure that's sturdy. And then take the filer, file it off. We did a really good job this time. Look how pretty. Okay, then we're gonna wait to cure this in a little bit. We're gonna move on and repeat the process. Ooh, this one's pretty. Ooh, that one's so pretty. Okay, that's so weird. That's my thumb and that's my index finger. Press it down. Kind of use this to help. Look how pretty. We're gonna do another glitter one. Perfect fitting. Oh my gosh. Ooh. Okay, now I have to cure it with the LED light. Wham, bam, let go. First I do my four fingers and then I'll do my thumb last. So this is one side done and look how pretty the design is. Okay, I'm gonna do my other hand and then I'll show you guys all my fingers. Okay guys, this is the finished left hand and this is the finished right hand. I love this French tip design, especially with the shattered glass. It makes me miss Korea so much. Pretty. Look it. Wow. Wow. That is it for today's vlog. Thanks for tuning in. I will be vlogging tomorrow, hopefully, for my main channel, but we'll see. I'm gonna like wash up, go shower, go to bed. It's like midnight. If you didn't have a good day, you can always make tomorrow better. Good night.